doesn't do you start it doesn't run them yet. It's comedy lane just turning. That's it, they're away. Russell and outside edge just dwell a tiny bit. Mr. Peak Peacock going on from Comedy Lane. Outside edge right up with them. And also Eaton Rouge. All eleven safely over the first. Mr. Peacock and Comedy Lane. These two are disputing it. They jump the first of the ditches. And all over the first of the ditches with Gatter and Oscar the back marker. Mr. Peacock from Comedy Lane with Eaton Rouge up there on the outside. On the inner is uh, General Joy. Between horses is the Thirsty Farmer over the fourth. All safely over it. Mr. Peacock from Comedy Lane. And a frequent course winner, four time course winner, Eaton Rouge, lying third over the fifth. Cool Ground is right up with the lead, and there's the Thirsty Farmer, and then General Joy, and then Fitzherbert as they run to the next. Right out in the country now, Mr. Peacock lands in the lead, and they're all safely over it with uh, Gatter and Oscar. Just the back marker, and Fitzherbert's being pulled up by the look at it. Fitzherbert surely being pulled up to reduce the field to 10 as they swing left-handed. Mr. Peacock, the leader, from Eaton Rouge, a confirmed stir. Then on the outside comes Casper Carrot. Then on the inner is Comedy Lane. Then General Joy and the Thirsty Farmer and Cool Ground. And they are being followed by Outside Edge. Then Russell. So they swing towards the seventh. Mr. Peacock, still the leader from Eaton Rouge. Comedy Lane going well on the outside. General Joy right up there, prominent, and so is Casper Carrot. Cool ground and outside edge. Gatter and Oscar still just the back marker. And into the ninth. And still Mr. Peacock, the leader. Mr. Peacock lands in the lead from Eaton Rouge, then General Joy, and over on the far side still Comedy Lane. On the near side, Casper Carrot, Cool Ground, Outside Edge. Roussel, the Thirsty Farmer, Gatto and Oscar still just the back marker. This will be the last fence on the next circuit. Over the 11th, Mr. Peacock. The leader from Casper Carrot, the top weight on the near side, on the far side, Comedy Lane, then Eaton Rouge, and then comes General Joy. Behind General Joy is Cool Ground and Outside Edge in the Sheepskin Noseband, going very sweetly at the moment. Then the Thirsty Farmer. On the inside of the Thirsty Farmer is Russell, and then Gutter and Oscar getting a lot closer. Gatter and Oscar, I understand, uh, gateway over the water, but insofar as the pronunciation is concerned, I'm afraid I haven't got the help of Mr. James Wade of Sutton Park, uh, Dublin, who nearly always uh, writes me with uh, uh, his phonetic pronunciations, which I have to say uh, at least 50% uh, James always disagree with, so this, uh, you can't be right pronouncing uh, Gaelic names. Mr. Peacock. No uh, pronunciation difficulties with him, being followed by Eaton Rouge, the four times course winner, Comedy Lane, and then Casper Carrot, outside edge, General Joy on the inside, Coolidge comes next, Russell next, then the Thirsty Farmer and Gutter and Oscar over the 12th, Mr. Peacock still. Mr. Peacock making it from Comedy Lane. Eaton Rouge, General Joy going well. Behind them, Cool Ground. Outside Edge. Casper Carrot has lost a little ground. Casper Carrot lost a little more ground there. 
So they race towards the water now for the last time. Number 15 of the 22 fences, Mr. Peacock from General Joy jumps it second. Comedy Lane jumps it third. Cool Ground and Eaton Rouge next. Then comes Outside Edge and Casper Carrot and then Russell. 16th now. Mr. Peacock from General Joy jumps it second. Mistake there by Comedy Lane. Eaton Rouge is third. Four is Cool Ground. Five is Outside Edge. Still going well. Casper Carrot just behind him and then Comedy Lane behind. Comedy Lane is Russell. And the back marker still Gutter and Oscar. Five left to jump. Mr. Peacock has the advantage from General Joy, Eaton Rouge, Cool Ground, Outside Edge, Casper Carrot, Long Run then to Russell. As they race now towards the home turn, Mr. Peacock being pressed all the time by General Joy and Eaton Rouge and Outside Edge still running very sweetly indeed just behind that three then come Cool Ground there's a gap then to Russell and behind Russell comes the top weight Casper Carrot making now towards the fifth from home and as they do so it's Mr. Peacock towards the left upsides him almost is General Joy then outside edge towards the left in the sheepskin noseband as they come down now to the final ditch Mr. Peacock on the far side General Joy in the center and outside edge in the sheepskin noseband towards the near side and outside edge jumps up with Mr. Peacock there as they come down now towards the third last in this save and prosper chase Mr. Peacock from outside edge General Joy, Cool Ground making ground, Cool Ground making very good ground as they run down now towards the second last and pulled up General Joy, he's fallen in fact General Joy on the flat on the far side, Mr. Peacock on the near side, it's still outside edge and outside edge travelling well as they come down to the final fence, outside edge who's been travelling smoothly all the way is going to land just in the lead, he lands in the lead, outside edge lands in the lead from Mr. Peacock and Cool Ground as they race into the closing stages. It's Outside Edge being pressed by Cool Ground. Cool Ground beginning to get up as they come to the line. Cool Ground is going to win it at the line. Cool Ground has won it. Very close for second with Roussel just getting up to be second to beat this horse who looked like the winner all the way Outside Edge. And in fourth place the long-time leader Mr. Peacock who sadly looks as though he's broken down. And behind them come Eaton Rouge. Behind Eaton Rouge is Gatter and Oscar and then the Thirsty Farmer and Casper Carrot. Well, tragically, I'm afraid that horse who was ridden last time by the Princess Rock.